So you might be trying to figure out how you can passcode lock TikTok on your iPhone. Now, doing this is actually very, very basic, and it really doesn't take too much time at all. The first thing you want to do is make sure you have the TikTok application installed on your iPhone. As you can see for me, I don't even have it installed here, so I'm going to go ahead and install it. And you also want to make sure that you basically have the Shortcuts application installed as well. So install Shortcuts. It looks like the uh, you know standard Shortcuts application. You should already have it installed. So what you're going to want to do is make sure you have those two apps installed. Now what you want to do now is you want to open up the Shortcuts application. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be building an automation that looks like this. So it's going to ask for text with password. It's going to you know have an if statement, and then it's going to open up that you know statement or that application if that particular app matches that passcode. So when we're in this page, what we want to do. We want to open up shortcuts and we want to click on this automation page right here and then what we're going to want to do is click on the plus button and we want to create a new automation so click on that plus, uh, plus button right there and what we're going to want to do is we're going to ask for input so you basically want to come up here and you want to so you basically want to click add action and you want to have basically just put in the ask button right there and you should be able to see an option that comes up that ask for ask for input which is right there so we're going to ask for text with a prompt so this prompt can basically be something, anything. I basically just type in password. Basically, it'll ask for a password. And we want to go ahead and add the if statement now. So what we can do is we can click on the plus button on this if statement. And if provided input, we want to tap on the condition. And we have this as is. Now, this text is what you want the password to be. So whatever the password you want it to be, you can go and place it here. In this case, we'll just do it one, two, three. Just something basic, something easy. So it's going to ask for that. Now, what we want to have happen and what we want to do is we want to add a little statement for our open app application. So we want to click on this little search bar at the bottom and we want to type in open. So we want to type in open app just like this and we want to go and find this little open app option. So tap on open app and we want to go and click on the app that we want to open. In this case, it's going to be TikTok. So find that little TikTok app, which is right there. And what we're going to want to do here is drag this above and under this particular application. Now, as you can see, this matches almost identically to what we have what we have here, except minus some applications and stuff. So now what we can do is we can go and click on the share button at the bottom, and we want to go and share this and add this to our home screen. So click here. You can click add to home screen, which is right there. Now, what we want is we want to find the application icon for TikTok. So what you can do is you can just type in TikTok icon. So type in TikTok icon just like this, and you should be able to see it come up. So what we want to do basically is we want to find this application. We want to go and hold it down and want to click save to photos. So now what we want to do is we want to change this particular name to the name of this application. So in this case, it's going to be TikTok. You want to tap on the name here, click on choose photo and basically bring in this you know icon that we had before. And whenever you're ready, you want to click add and watch what happens. You may have to edit up this icon a little bit further, but you'll basically have two TikTok applications. Now, when you click on TikTok, it'll ask for the passcode instead of actually opening up the app. And you want to type in that passcode that we just had set up earlier. And watch when you do that, you'll click done and it'll open up the TikTok app. Now, if you type in the wrong passcode, so let's say I just type in a bunch of stuff, it's just not going to do anything. So that's basically how it's done. You can then delete the order or remove from the home screen for the TikTok app and then keep this on your home screen. And that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.